hi there once again this is a sequel to my earlier video my earlier video was about uh, travel during covid covid 19 i shared my experience of uh, my journey from overseas to chennai in this video i will be covering some bit of details about uh, the permits or the e passes that is required to travel between one town or one city to another city in another state i chose a transport company drop taxi to take me from chennai to bangalore there were two e passes required one e pass was from chennai to the border in, uh, in hosur and the other one was from hosur to enter bangalore the first e pass was arranged by the transport company i sent them my aadhar card my aadhar card had uh, the bangalore address so using the aadhar card and my phone number they prepared the pass i was sent the otp which i sent them i got uh, by sms a link to download the e pass this is how the tn e pass looks like on top there's an yellow highlight uh, which says tn to ka tamil nadu to karnataka i'll just enlarge uh, for a clearer view it has the pass number my details my mobile number father's name age what type of vehicle it is what is the reason there are options given online when you apply so you can select the reason which check post and what kind of id proof that i will be producing i produce the aadhar card so this has the aadhar card number there are three pages to it and uh, one is uh, the uh, first page that has the details of me and the car car number second page has the general instructions which has the number of passengers what uh, kind of quarantine rules they have to follow so you can go through this and the third page has the driver's details his name his age and what is his aadhar number so this pass is required to travel from chennai to hosur the second e pass is to enter bangalore from the state toll border in hosur this was applied by me online when i was on quarantine in the hotel in chennai now i'll take you through the process in google you choose seva sindhu english if you just type seva sindhu it will take you to a, a sheet a page which will have everything in kannada so the option is yours if you choose seva sindhu english it opens up to this page and you choose the first option which is seva sindhu portal when you click on that it opens up a form this is a form that we have to fill up there are several options like travel to karnataka by road train flight then travel to other states as a migrant laborer if you are traveling from another country so there's an option for this and there are several other options so based on whatever is your requirement you choose the one that you want to follow now my in my case i was traveling from chennai to bangalore so i chose travel to karnataka option so when i chose that it opened up to a form if you see this has both uh, in kannada as well as in english so the traveler details had to be filled up so i filled up uh, the name of the traveler mobile number and all these details and the present address since i was staying in chennai i entered those details and which to which destination i was traveling so once i filled up all these details and i clicked submit it opened up to a permit it automatically produced a permit which was the e pass that i had to show at the border in hosu border now this has got name and all the other details that uh, you had entered with this when i had produced this so they immediately they verified in their computer and they made an entry and it was mandatory at the bangalore uh, border that any traveler entering has to follow 14 days quarantine although i had finished 7 days um, in chennai here it was required for me to follow 14 days while uh, traveling between chennai to bangalore there are few checkpoints where i had to produce this first e pass which is tamil nadu e pass 
tea and nipas and uh, once i showed this and mentioned that i'm going to bangalore they just gestured me to carry on otherwise i found uh, many of them stopping their car getting off and making some entries this i believe could be for travelers within tamil nadu once i entered um, bangalore i received a call from the bangalore authorities local authorities if i have received the quarantine instructions and requesting me to follow this uh, adhere to this quarantine rules so this was my short experience of traveling from chennai to bangalore during uh, covid times and i had entered bangalore during strict lockdown for one week which was between 18th and 22nd probably now the rules would have got uh, more relaxed however it depends on the number of covid cases that surfacing so this was my experience and stay tuned i will be uh, making more videos on several topics that might be of interest stay protected thank you